CA Pay. Back at you with another video. And in today's quick video, I'm filling up to ride out for a little bit. Go ride, uh, I think we're gonna ride downtown Chicago, man. Pick up some stragglers on the way. Bike looking good, we're about to gas up, have to clean the helmet off. Um, bike is still under construction a little bit. We got a few things going on. But I put a little over a thousand miles on it so far. And um, definitely, definitely loving it. Definitely loving it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What has went on this thing so far? Um, new rims, new tires. I'm going to see what I'm going to do with the old rims and the old, well, I might do something special to the old rims to see if I can, like, trick them out, make them look good, put some paint to them, something. Um, we got the top light at the top. We got the red light at the back. We got the front A-arm lights and the rear, these are the rear A-arm lights. And we got the front A-arm lights. Got the emblem right here done. Um, speakers, Rock for Five Skate. Got them young Rock for Five Skates. They loud as hell. They look like, they honestly look like probably eight and a half, but they, they six and a half, but they loud as hell. I think that canister, because of how deep it is, I think that's what makes it loud. What else? We have a Can-Am exhaust coming. Cannot wait to get that exhaust. It's a pretty expensive exhaust, but it's gonna make, make the bike sound amazing. What else? Uh, just the basic stuff like the phone holder things and uh, these grips, these uh, um, steering wheel, ends or whatever those are on there as well little cup holder not sure if i like it yet gonna leave it for now not sure if i like it the backrest the seats are gonna get done in a couple of weeks so see the it's gonna be more orange stitching so we're gonna put some orange stitching on the back and orange stitching on the top of the seat what else what else? oh uh the highway pegs, I like this highway peg. I did have the brake extension on here too, but the brake extension came all the way over here and I don't know, when I put my foot down, I felt like I was hitting both of them. And when I need to get on that brake, I need to get on that brake. So I took it off for now. But I know we got the CA paint plate on the back. All right, so these are not factory, right? So those don't come out the factory like that these lights right here so that's added we got the afterburner lights on the, on the end that's why i wanted to keep that back fender because i don't know some people said that the back fender looks kind of like dated or something or just like an old man back fender but honestly i like the back fender because i can put extra things on it and i don't know it's just in my head it's more security with it right we got the jl audio controller right here to control that young music um what else right here we got those uh to where you can see more behind you so i put those on there so you can see more in your review mirrors again got the rims done i don't even know what else i want to get done obviously you see lights i got the underglow lights i got the wheel lights so we got the Night Rider light in the front. The grill lights up. So quite a bit has been done to the bike. I've, I think I've had the bike for about four weeks. So in four weeks, you know, put quite a bit, few aftermarket mods on it. Some people are asking me what's next. Um. I'm not sure. I think I have enough lights. At least I have the whole winter to check out and figure out what I want to do next. I might add some more lights up front. Go ahead, blow up the comment section right now. Let me know 
spider riders what else should i add to it what else would you add to my spider f3 beautiful bike though i am definitely enjoying it one of the other things that's going to get added to it is this screen up here is will get switched out so it's going to get switched out for one of those new 2024 screens the one that has like all the apps and stuff on it so I already figured out that that can be done. So it'll get uh, switched out for one of those. Uh, what else? I might go Elka shocks. I'm not sure, but the upgrade I'm looking for right now is that exhaust. Y'all know, man, we don't stay stock exhaust. Y'all know that, ex that exhaust is what I'm looking forward to next. I still like these pegs. I really like the pegs. If I didn't, I would have already got those pegs that go from front to back. You get the other ones. But I really like these pegs. Uh, they're comfortable for me overall. So, you know, I don't always go with what everybody else has. I go with what works for me. So, get in the comment section. Let me know what else do you think I should get. Also, for you guys that have spiders, get in the comment section right now. Help your boy out. Let me know. The seat. When I push this seat down, is this just the manufacturer's flaw? When I push the seat down, one part of the seat, it just sticks up a little bit. So this part on this side is just a little higher than this part. It seems like, I don't know. So somebody was telling me that they thought it's because I added this backrest, but it was already kind of like that before I added the backrest. So get in the comment section, let me know what you guys know about that back seat. But I am enjoying it y'all. I should have bought a spider a long time ago. I would be lying to you if I told you any different. Yes, I'm keeping the Riker. I enjoy the Riker. But this spider, two, two different rides, man. When I go different places, um, when I go on the road or highway, I'm going out of state. I'm probably going to take this 100%. I'll probably never take the spider unless it's a show and I can trailer it there. The Spider is not the most, con I mean, I'm sorry, the Riker is not the most comfortable ride on the road. You're trying to get on the E-Way and highway and do 200 or 300 miles. But this Spider, hey, this thing is comfortable local and going anywhere else. This, this thing's the bomb, in my opinion. So get in the comment section, let me know if you agree with me. If you have a Spider, get in the comment section, let me know how long you've had your Spider. Uh, if you have a spider and a Riker and you got the best of both worlds just like me, get in the comment section and let me know. But for my spider riders, man, help me out. What else should I put on this bike? What else would you add to this spider to just make it one of the top ones out there? Please hit that subscribe button to become a part of this wonderful three-wheel community. Until next time, my friends, CA Pate out.